Today we are learning how to multiply fractions by using a model. Let's say we're trying to multiply one half times one third. Well, we'll start by drawing a model of one half. Then to multiply it by one third, we'll first focus on breaking this into thirds. I could break up this model into three equal sections. Now I'm multiplying this by one third, so I'm going to shade in just one of these sections. Now I ask myself, what fraction of the model has been shaded twice? This will be my answer. We can see that just this one piece has been shaded twice, and it's out of a total of six. So as a fraction, one sixth of the model has been shaded twice. One half times one third equals one sixth. Now let's practice one of these together. Let's figure out what one third times one fifth equals. We'll start by drawing a model of one third. Then what should I do to multiply this by one fifth? Well, because we're multiplying by fifths, we'll break this model into five equal sections. And we're only multiplying by one of these, so we'll only shade in one of these fifths. Now, how can I tell from this model what my answer is? I ask myself, what fraction of the model has been shaded twice? Well, what fraction of this model has been shaded twice? We can see this one piece right here, and it's out of a total of 15. So as a fraction, 1 15th of this model has been shaded twice. That's our answer. Now let's do one more together. Let's figure out what 1 3rd times 1 3rd equals. We'll start with another model. Then to multiply by 1 3rd, what should I do? Well, we're multiplying by a third, so we'll break the model into three equal sections. And because we're multiplying by 1 3rd, we'll shade in only one of these sections. Now from looking at the model, what is the answer to 1 3rd times 1 3rd? Well, you look at the number of pieces that have been shaded twice. We can see one of them right here. And that's out of a total of 9. So our answer is 1 3rd times 1 3rd is 1 9th. Now it's time for you to practice on your own. What is 1 4th times 1 half? Well, if you draw a model to show 1 4th, then you can multiply by 1 half by splitting it into two equal sections. We're only multiplying by one of those, so we'll shade in just one of those sections. Then we see one piece has been shaded twice, and it's out of a total of eight. So one fourth times one half is one out of eight. Now here's your last problem for this video. What is one fourth times one fourth? Start by drawing a model of one fourth. Then to multiply it by one fourth, we'll break it into four equal sections. Because we're only multiplying by one fourth, we'll only shade in one of those sections. Then we can see that one piece has been shaded twice, and that's out of a total of 16 pieces in this model. So one fourth times one fourth is one sixteenth. Today you learned how to multiply fractions by using a model.